morning everybody today it is the 27th of january around 10 o'clock and i'm going on my way to the sultan ahmed mosque and Hagia sophia mosque i was actually to do this yesterday but we didn't have enough time because they closed pretty early and i didn't know that so now i woke up very early for my taste and now i'm going my mom is still in the hotel she's sleeping she has been dancing until four o'clock in the midnight, I think. Well, sorry, I'm walking up, guys. I'm gonna find it on my own, and then I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. I'm excited, and let's do it. Okay guys, I'm in the entrance. The ticket is 60 TL, uh, which is 10 euros. But if you are a Turkish citizen, so not really living in Turkey, but you have a Turkish passport or a Turkish ID card, then you can buy uh, 10 TL more. So for 70 TL, you can buy a museum card, which you can use for up to one year. And you can get free entrance into all the museums around Istanbul. Okay, so I bought an audiobook. It's 30 TL. I thought it would be like the audiobook at um, uh, at the Doma Bahce, at the uh, Doma Bahce Palace, but it really is not. <laughs> the church was built around 500 after Christ, uh, and it used to be a church. Now it's used as a museum. Uh, and parts of the museum are redecorated or rebuilt uh, since there was a, a big um, earthquake. Uh, a lot of them, a lot of it has been destroyed but restored as well. So yeah. it started as a basilisk, then it became a cathedral, and then later in the reign of Ataturk, uh, they have turned it into a mosque. Um, and now, since 1930, it has been a museum where people can visit um, and just enjoy this. So in Turkish they call it uh, Aya Sofia and here in, the, uh, in English they call it Hagia Sophia. So Hagia Sophia means God's holy wisdom. Okay, peeps, on this side, here you see the Ayasofya Mosque. And right on the other side, this one, is the Blue Mosque. Uh, it looks grey on the outside, it's called the Blue Mosque because on the inside they have blue tiling. So I'm just gonna go over there. Um, you had to pay to go into the Museum of Ayasofya, but you do not have to pay to go into the Blue Mosque. And the Blue Mosque is also known as the Sultan Ahmed Mosque. Guys, so you cannot enter the mosque without your hair covered, so you need to bring a scarf or a headband or something to not show your hair, and then you can go inside. Okay, I have to film like this, otherwise you will not see it. So because of tiling like this in this color, they call it the blue mosque.
Okay, guys, I'm in the Basilica Cistern, which is one of the Asian buildings in Istanbul. Uh, it was built underground in order to keep as a water reservoir. So they uh, stored water here in order to, um, like, when there was when there would be a need for the water, they could get it from the reservoir. So since there used to be a basilica in place of the cistern, it's called Basilica Cistern, and it can store up to 100,000 tons of water. Uh, the water that was reserved within this uh, cistern was uh, brought from the Belgrade forest and uh, the cistern is supported by a lot of columns so these are the columns and maybe on the photo it looks like some kind of steel but it's actually all marble so guys these columns are also called the crying columns because they appear to be uh, wet and crying uh, the reason that they built this is in memorial of the slaves who died building the great basilica So the thing I just showed you was the head of Medusa and uh, on the northeast or the southeast, somewhere on the east side of this uh, uh, basilisk cistern thing, there are two uh, pillars with the heads of Medusa. So one is the head to the side and the one, other one I'm going to show you right now. And Medusa was seen as one of the uh, under gods, the gods of the underground, underworld. I don't know why they put it here. Uh, it doesn't say it anywhere why they put her head here, maybe. But you can recognize that it's her because of the snake uh, hair. Okay, so I'm reading about the Medusa heads right now. It says the two Medusa heads are used to support uh, the, under the two columns at the northwest edge of the cistern. But what attracts the most attention from the visitors is that the structure from which the Medusa heads have been taken is unknown. The heads are from the Roman period and apparently from an, from an existing uh, structure. But which structure it is and with what cause is really unknown. But they say probably it was to support the lower columns. But it's funny that like the heads they didn't make it themselves, they took it from another structure. Guys, we are currently in the Egyptian market and the smell here smells so good. I like, I love the smell. It smells like a... Bahara. No. Like a spices. It smells like a curry spice maybe. No, it's not curry. What do I smell? A lot of spices only, only mixed. Spice. And it smells delicious. My mom is buying something. What are you buying? I buy uh, uh, something uh, for my friend. She asked me to bring can you take this please? No. It's okay. It's very very light. I buy this for my uh, for my father. Because he lost it. Okay, when you buy the cheese and the stuff, you can get it in a vacuum package, so that will be free, uh, without any charge, they will pack it in. Oh, oh. <laughs> Wow! <laughs> Wow, 
Wow. What are you eating, bacon? Wow. It looks delicious. Chicken. But it's not like how I make it. You make it better? Oh, for sure. <laughs> Oh, can I take one uh, potato? Video of all these people who do it, do it. Kaisha, Kaisha, I don't see. Kaisha. No, if you just do it, it's not. Kill this guy or, or whatever you say. Destroy his face. Zabit kurmela. The same sentence. You, you, you are getting on YouTube, eh? You are getting on YouTube, eh? I want to listen at home. Lake. Oh. Lake. No, lake. Ah, this is oh. the Yes, hey. not there. Not there. This is all the bad things. <laughs> For you. you. need to look inside, not outside. It's quite separate, like oil and water, but like in there. Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 <laughs> yes. Yeah, room. Yeah. Oh, what? It's, it's so many relationships show up in here. How many? <laughs> What's the bird with the big, beautiful tail? Oh, a peacock. Peacock. A peacock. <laughs> it's like a, which is probably you. <laughs> Am I a peacock? <laughs> peacock. <laughs> Guys? So guys, today it is the 28th of January and we are getting ready to go to the airport because we're flying back today to Holland and I'm a little excited because I can finally go home and sleep in my own bed where it's clean. Bütün kış dağlarımda soğurcuklar var. 